Okay, right in today's video here, we're gonna be doing another tier list here. I haven't done one of these in quite a while. Anyways, uh, today I'm gonna be ranking each outfit from the Greek Legends collection here. Uh, that is Bulk for Killer and Survivor. And uh, yeah, uh, enjoy the video. <laughs> Okay, right, let's go ahead and get started here. First thing first, we got LOD's Bearer of Gifts outfit. Now, this outfit is not bad. I don't like the hair that much, to be honest. My opinion, the hair is a kind of a letdown, but other than that, the rest of the outfit looks pretty good, in my opinion. I think I'm gonna put this in good tier, to be honest. It's not amazing, but it's pretty decent. Nice. Next up over here, we've got the Champion of Olympus David outfit. Now, I don't play David that much, in fact, I don't think I've played him in years. But overall, I quite like his hairstyle and all. It's not a bad outfit. So I think this guy deserves a spot in good tier as well. Next up, we got the Fairy Man of the Underworld Blight outfit here. Whoa, whoa. Now, when this skin came out, I was gonna originally get it, but I don't play Blight that much, so I never did. But I think overall, personally, this skin is a solid 9 out of 10. It's quite an amazing skin, to be honest. Well, I think good is where this is going to go. What the? Next up here, we got the Furious Nyx Spirit outfit here. This skin I actually quite like. I quite like like the armor thing she has. I quite like the shoulder blade pads as well. I think this deserves a spot in amazing tier, not gonna lie. Th that's actually pretty good. What? Next up over here, we got the God of Wine A skin. To be honest, not my favorite A skin here, but although it's pretty okay, I guess. I say it goes in between either good tier or mid, to be honest. I think it deserves a spot in good tier, though. It's not mid, it's not bad or anything, it's just overall decent. Ah! Next up here, we got the Goddess of Victory Yui outfit. The only thing that I don't like about the skin is mainly the hairstyle, it has to a little bit let down for me. But other than that, it's a pretty amazing skin, not gonna lie. I definitely think it deserves a spot up there in amazing day. <laughs> Next up, we have the Goddess of Warfare Fang outfit here. I love this outfit. I'm just gonna go ahead and say I quite like this Fang outfit. Originally, I did not like the hairstyle. I don't know why I didn't like the hairstyle at first. Now, it's okay. I don't find it that bad. But I think overall... It definitely des they deserve the spot up there in the basic tier, without a doubt. Yeah, that's all good. Next up here, we got the Hecate's he 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 Offering. I definitely butchered that name. <laughs> now, I'm gonna be honest. Good skin, very good skin. Terrible hairstyle. That hairstyle is honestly... It could use some work. I think overall, it deserves a spot in good tier, not gonna lie. Next up here, we got the Herald of the Gods Adam outfit. Now, this outfit really doesn't have much to it, to be honest. It's not bad, it's quite an okay outfit in my opinion. It's not good or amazing, it's just an all-around average outfit in my opinion. It's not bad. So I think I'm going to go ahead and put this in mid, to be honest. <laughs> Next up here, we got the Huntress Goddess Talid outfit here. Overall, I think it's a pretty decent good, it's a pretty decent skin to be honest. I quite like the outfit, quite like the hairstyle and all. It's not quite an amazing tier. I feel like the amazing tier is not where it should go. But I think it definitely deserves a spot in good tier, not gonna lie. Next up here, we got the image of the fairy's artist skin here. What the? Now, to be honest, this skin is honestly, it looks quite cool. Not gonna lie, quite like how the mouth kind of fits into her neck or something. It's not bad, it's quite a unique outfit. It's not amazing tier, I feel like. But I'd say it's pretty alright, I guess it's pretty decent, I guess, for his skin. Next up over here, we got the King of Athens Renato outfit. 
This skin is not too bad, it's, it's quite okay I guess, in my opinion it's pretty decent, I think overall it's pretty decent, it's pretty good, so I'm gonna put that up there in good tier I guess. Next up over here we got the Lord of the Underworld Clown Outfit. <laughs> now this skin kind of hilarious, not gonna lie. Then again, I find almost every clown outfit hilarious at this point. I think overall, in general, this clown outfit is, is something. It's definitely something to say the least. I guess it basically helps to mid to good, to be honest. But purely for the memes, I'm gonna put that up there in good tier. Nice. Next up here, we got the Goddess Queen Zarine outfit. Now, to be honest, the moment this outfit came out, I immediately wanted this. I quite like this outfit, to be fair. I think this outfit definitely is one of the best in here in the Greek Legends collection. So I think this definitely deserves a spot in amazing tier, without a doubt. Next up here, we got the lyrical goddess Kate outfit. Again, an absolutely solid 10 out of 10 skin, to be honest. One of the best Kate skins out there. I do feel like this skin also deserves a spot in amazing tier. It's just all around pretty nice. It's pretty unique. Next up here, we got the Goddess Mouse Jane outfit here. Now, this one is honestly pretty cool. I quite like the full white dress thing. It really fits with the greeting quite a lot. It is quite nice. I feel like I'm gonna put this one in good tier. Next up over here, we got the Titan of Fire Jeff outfit. My name is Jeff. Now, to be honest, kind of a mid outfit. <laughs> it's just an overall average skin in my opinion here. There's nothing much to it. It's just you're out of your normal average Jeff outfit. To be honest, I kind of feel bad for Jeff. I do feel like he needs a little bit more better cosmetic, not gonna lie. But purely because it's Jeff, I'm gonna put that up there in good tier. Next up here, we got the Sea Goddess Plague outfit here. Plague D! Overall, I think this Plague skin is not bad. Pretty unique in its own way, I would say. It's not super top tier. I wouldn't say it fits in an amazing tier quite well. But I'd say it's a pretty decent good looking skin, not gonna lie. Next up here, we got the Rind Ram Nusa Retribution. Um, yeah, I, I definitely butchered that name 1000%. <laughs> I feel like overall this Nia skin looks pretty good. The only thing I don't like about it is the hairstyle. I feel like the hairstyle is a big letdown for this outfit. But other than that, I would say it's a pretty solid outfit to be honest. I still think this is for an amazing tier. I might change that later on, but for now, I think amazing tier is where it should be. Seriously? Next up here, we got the Minotaur Oni outfit here. This skin is honestly pretty cool, it's actually quite unique. I quite love uh, the aspects of the skin, I, I saw where the devs were going with this. Honestly, pretty solid 8 out of 10 skin in my opinion. Overall, it also hovers between amazing and good tier. In my opinion, it, it should go in good tier. Nice. Next up here, we got the Vengeful Enchantress Nurse outfit here. To be honest, I think overall this nurse skin, I would give it roughly a 6.5 out of 10. Though it is not the worst skin to be honest. I would put that up there in good tier. But mainly because it's a nurse, I'm gonna be slightly disbiased and uh, I'm just gonna put that up there in trash. <laughs> Last but not least here, we have the War is Hell Dredge outfit here. Dredge outfits are always quite... <laughs> weird in my opinion then again it is dredge it is a weird killer but i think overall it's an okay outfit to be honest it's okay i guess it's not a super top tier outfit i'd say it's around a six i guess so i'm gonna put that up there mid tier to be honest hey okay, actually now that i think about it i'm gonna put blight skin up there in amazing tier not gonna lie I, th I feel like this skin definitely deserves a spot up there at this point. Yeah, I, I, I feel like, yeah, that's, that's where it should belong. Anyways, this is gonna be it for the Greek Collection Outfits tier list. 
I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I know some of you are gonna agree with my choices, some of you are gonna disagree. That's usually how every tier list goes. Anyways, with all that said, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a good night, guys.